Please do not forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. It goes a long way. It really does. Hello, fool lovers. It's good you're here. Lily Lee was born on June 14, 1950, in Hong Kong. She is a well-known film and television actress who starred in classic movies such as The Executioners from Shaolin, One Foot Cream, and The Young Master, and the television series The Bride with White Hair and Demi Guards and Semi Devils. Lily would get her education at the Christian school and started training with Shaw Brothers Acting School at the age of 11, where she was taught to speak Mandarin, acting, dancing, and martial arts. At the age of 14 in 1964, Lily made her debut in the movie The Last Woman of Shan. In the years 1964 to 1965, she would feature in four films, mainly in minor roles. She would then get signed to an exclusive acting contract with Shaw Studios in 1966. That same year, she would star in six movies, including the Chen Pei Pei classic, Come Drink With Me. After a few years of playing supporting roles, Lily would rise to fame when she got her first leading role in the 1970 film, The Wandering Swordsman, which was directed by Chang Che and also starred David Chang. As the years progressed, Lily would become one of the more popular Shaw Brother actresses. From the late 60s through to the 70s, she would appear in many Kung Fu films and was at one time closely associated with legendary director and actor, La Calion. In her early career with Shaw Brothers Studio, Lily appeared in many martial art dramas, often playing strong heroines. She would then join the television network Jai TV and starred as the heroine in the television series The Bride with White Hair. After the closure of Jai TV in 1978, Lily went back to Taiwan and starred in several martial art movies such as Relentless Broken Blade and One Foot Crane. In 1980, Lily would star in numerous episodes of the TV series Light and Shadow in My City for Hong Kong public broadcaster RTHK. She would still find the time to star in eight movies, including The Young Master with Jackie Chan. In 1980, Lily joined Asia Television, ATV, then known as Ready Fusion Television, where she would go on to star in several television series, including Blood Death, Superhero, Drunken Fist 2, and The Devil Force, just to name a few. Even as she was with ATV, Lily would continue to travel to Taiwan to do other television dramas like Elephant Flying Across the River, and Shaolin Disciple. She would also appear in Hong Kong films such as Dagger's Eight and Dreadnought. Lily would leave Asia Television and go over to TVP in 1988. There she would feature in numerous supporting roles in such series as The Final Combat, The Legend of the Invincible, and Beauty at War. After a 32-year partnership that produced three awards for her, in January 2020, Lily would decide not to renew her contract and would choose to part ways with TVB. With a career spanning 56 years that saw her starring in over 100 movies and in close to 100 television series, Lily is now getting some well-deserved rest and relaxation, secured in the knowledge that her legacy in martial arts cinema is well intact. To Lily Lee we say, thanks for the memories. If you have enjoyed this video, please like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell and feel free to leave a comment. Thank you and may the food be with you.